Please pop. I'm gonna pass out. Oh, son. Yeah, boy. Hi, Snakeys. It's me, Fifi, and I'm back. I'm back again today with part two of my May uh, King Cobra Patreon requests. And you yeah, got nothing else to say. Let's just go. Disclaimer. I don't like to react with captions on as I find them distracting. I like to concentrate on the music and the music production is what I like to comment on the most. When I'm looking at the words at the bottom of the screen, I'm missing parts of the song, their vocals, and I'm missing parts of the MV and choreo. I'll read the lyrics later in my own time. Okay, so first up we have King Cobra Sin's request. Shout out to you Sin, thank you so much for staying. King Cobra Snakey, Snakey, Snakey. King Cobra Snakey and supporting me. Um, so Sin has an, a couple of requests, the first one being uh, Damien. Now I've had a lot of requests for Damien um, in the past and then the request kind of slowed down a little bit and I completely forgot about him. Also a couple of my reactor friends really really dig his music. I just haven't gotten the chance to check him out yet so thank you so much for uh, choosing this in and giving me the chance to finally listen to one of his songs. Uh, so Sin has chosen Love Percent and this is featuring Don. This is about to be fire. Let's go. Oh, already. Mm. Woo. Oh. Woo. Ah! I wish, 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 I just like Ah, oh, this bit is 
That's perfect. Oh, that sounds so good. Yo, that shit slappity slap. See, do you ever sometimes just sit back and think to yourself, why am I such a dumb bitch? Like, do you ever sit like sit back and think to yourself, like, why am I so stupid? Because I I love So Young as a solo artist. Why why have I not listened to her group's music? Why have I just not listened to their entire discography? Like why? Why? Because I'm a dumb bitch. Again, thank you Super <laughs> for requesting this. I absolutely love that. That was definitely giving me sort of 70s soul influences. Um, it, uh, it also, it's giving me neo soul vibes as well. Um, I gathered it was gonna be like that from the previous track of theirs I'd heard before. And of course, so on the solo music, but I just wasn't expecting to the vibe of it as much as that, bro. And then, Like, that melody, oh, the instrumentation, the, that instrumental moment, that whole fucking thing, with the electric, you know the instrumental moment, I mean, with that, 10 out of 10, it's a 10 out of 10 for me, that's it, I'm done, I'm done with Sin, Sin, I'm done with you, uh, thank you so much for being King Cobra Snakey and snaking the fuck out of me again this week, uh, this month, uh, yeah, let's go on to the next one. Okay, so next up we have King Cobra Amir's request. Shouts to you, Amir. Thank you so much for uh, staying, remaining a King Cobra Snakey for another month. Now, Amir has requested, um, a, a more, you know, I'm already another couple of bangers. Um, the first one Amir's requested is a song by Charlie Taft. Now, Charlie Taft is a name I've seen a billion times um, in K pop. Uh, she writes a lot of K pop songs, a lot of your faves music. Um, I can't sit here and list all of them right now, uh, but she's done a lot. Uh, and I've always wanted to like check out her solo stuff. I actually wasn't really aware she had solo stuff, but I have in the past seen her name and sort of wanted to look her up. Um, I just never got around to it. So thank you so much, Amir, for giving me the opportunity to finally check her out. I'm going to be reacting to the Love Like You MV, and it's actually an SM station, which is kind of wild to me. Uh, yeah, let's go. No! Mm. Down, down. No! Okay, lower. I'm gonna be sick. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I can play it down. There's nothing to 
I'm out of no I'm good. I'm gonna get through to you. I'm a sequence and the way it just remained all throughout I could just hear those three chords again and again and again and again you guys know me give me a chord progression or a chord sequence just as tasteful as that and I'm dead I'm, I'm dead I'm good I'm done but the synths and the bloop, 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 the melody see this is what she does best the melodies the little intricate little ad libs and the little runs the little extra things that she does that probably adds to the songs I love so much absolutely fucking superb and her voice is top notch she's got the skills but she also has a really really nice tone she's stunning I'm a fan I'm a stan I stan Charlie Taft is it Charlie Taft or Charlie Taft I'm not sure I stan anyway uh yeah let's go on to the next one okay so next up amir has requested some more uh getting back back getting um and this time where's the oh, okay this time i'm gonna be checking out uh maybe it's not our fault mb i'm super excited for this because i absolutely loved back last time uh 
Let's go. I can't. I just can't take any more. Defend the roads. I can't take any more. I can't take any more blings. I can't take it. Mm. Lady vocals, her own voice with a low register, is that someone else singing? That was absolutely brilliant, but I'm not surprised, I'm not snaked. I think I went into that one a little bit more prepared. Um, I, I, her voice is so smooth. That whole song was just so smooth and comforting. I love like the lo-fi, the lo I can't talk, the lo-fi vibes um, within the beat and I like the samples. You had like a lot of, it, it sounded like a sort of record, like you had that um, sort of sound going on all throughout and then you had like the samples of the, I think that was like samples of the strings and stuff um, that sounded so good the melodies oh my goodness gracious me there's two chords that, that progression I think it was at the end of the chorus um, and then the way she went into the bridge as well that whole thing was stunning I love the sort of reverb guitars as well the Fender Rhodes of course 
Um, I love the animations as well. It was very, very pretty. It went really, really well with the song. It was just giving me sort of coffee shop vibes, like, you know, cosy, warm vibes. Um, yeah, that was maybe more of a, like, a bit of a winter song, I think. Um, definitely one for the winter when you're sort of on your sofa, on your couch, or like I said, in the coffee shop. I don't know, or on the bus in the cold winter. It's raining and you're just... I don't know. Listen, that was a bop. Thank you so much, Amir, for requesting those. Um, that, I'm still fucking blown away by the fucking Charlie Taff, Charlie Taff, I don't know how you, I don't know how you pronounce it, but yeah, thank you so much for requesting those, uh, let's go on to the next one. Okay, so next up we have King Cobra Robin's request, shout out to you Robin, thank you so much for staying in King Cobra for another month. Uh, so Robin has requested an artist called Din Din, um, I love his name Din Din because I don't know, like, if anywhere else in the world does this, well, English-speaking countries, but in the UK we call dinner din din sometimes, <laughs> EMP din dins, um, so yeah, din din. Um, and the first uh, track that Robin has requested is featuring Queen from Mamamoo, um, and the song is actually produced by Giddy Boy. Um, it's called, I don't know if it's do 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 or do 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 do, because it isn't written in Hangul. Um, either way, let's go. Oh, I found a little video. Ooh, 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 ooh. Go. 
I loved how uh, the song ended there with the instrumental and that little guitar moment. It just sounded so good. And I feel like the production was so good. Um, and the instrumentation was so good. I'm glad that we had that little moment at the end to hear it a little bit more clearly. Um, I loved it. I loved the soulful vibes. It was very R&B. Again, it was giving me that so sort of coffee shop winter sort of mellow vibes. Um, I'm trying to work out what he is, if he's a singer or a rapper, if he's a rapper who's just decided to sing a bit, because I was getting a little bit of rap sing vibes. He has a very sort of, like he hasn't got like a super skilled voice or anything like that. He has a very sort of chilled, mellow voice, but a really nice tone. So I'm confused a little bit, but I really, really liked him. Um, that was a vibe queen. Queen on that track sounded fantastic and their voices together, like how her voice is so sort of soft and sweet and mellow and she is very skilled, mixed with his sort of laid back sort of uh, tone, it just went really well with the song as well, uh, I'm spitting my own bars, loved it, let's go on to the next one. Okay guys, let's go, so the next track that uh, Robin requested is one called Sleepless Night, I also found a little bit for this one as well, sorry I'm just like mumbling, uh, let's go. Previous track, 
This song actually reminded me of a Mamma Moo track. I think it might be Windflower. Like the that beat in the chorus, it was giving me, I think it is Windflower. Yeah. I, it was giving me sort of Mamma Moo vibes, which is interesting. I don't know if there's a connection there at all or what's going on there. Um, but I loved it. I loved the instrumentation in this. I love those uh, the plucky strings pizzicato. I think that's how you call them. Um, the doo -doo -doo, like I love that. Um, I also love those guitars that came in. Um, and I love that beat switch up, that sort of breakdown when it goes a little bit more sort of trap, a little bit more sort of R and B ish almost when you had that sort of really low synth, that bass. Um, I really, really love that part. Um, also, I think he is a rapper who does a bit of singing rather than a singer. Like, that, like I think he is like a rapper who just rap sings. Um, and he has his own unique style. I really, really like that. I liked him. I enjoyed both of those. Thank you so much, Robin, uh, for your request and for being the King Cobra Snakey. <sighs> Losing my words. Let's go on to the next one. Okay, guys. So next up, we have King Cobra Sebastian's request. Shouts to you, Seb. Thank you so much for staying in King Cobra Snakey for another month, for the month of May. I keep getting notifications. I've got my AirPods in. It's distracting me. Shh. Um, <laughs> so, Seb has requested an artist called Yura. Um, I've never heard of Yura before, so I'm going into this completely blind. Uh, I'm sure it's going to be vibes. I'm sure it's going to be bops. Uh, so the first track uh, Seb has requested is called Swim. This is Virus Edit. Uh, let's go. I already love those things. Give me like Donkey Kong. So good. I absolutely 
absolutely love that. It actually reminded me a little bit of uh, Sesanyan in a sense where it has just that fusion of sounds. You've got that indie sound, you've got your rocky elements, you've got your funky elements, you've got your soulful elements. It was very sort of progressive, it had that prog rock. Uh, sort of vibe to it as well. I loved it. She had a very, very sort of unique tone. Um, hey, baby, baby. And oh my god, that was fantastic. The instrumentation, the synths, uh, the guitar, the riffs, everything, the drums. I loved it. It was just a cool track. You know, one of those cool tracks, definitely one of those tracks you'd recommend to people just to be, just to seem cool, okay? If you want to be cool, like, recommend this track to people. I love the video as well, the visuals, it was very trippy. Also, I love sharks, this is a really random fact about me, but I have an obsession with sharks and great white sharks. So just seeing a the shark there made me so happy. I really like that. Not what I was expecting at all, but I'm very, very thankful. I love that. Hey, baby, baby. Let's go on to the next one. Okay, guys, so the next uh, Yura track that Seb has requested is called My Hair is Green, and we're going to be doing the MV. Let's go. That church organ. Ooh, that. Oh. Oh, this is giving me. You know, the 60s sort of surfer vibes, you know? I knew it was going to do that. I love her voice. Ooh, what's that like trombone or something? What is that? Let's tap. love that one as well i feel like the previous track was a little bit more of my vibe but i did still enjoy this one it was giving me i think it's like that 60s sort of rock and rock sort of vibe but especially the that guitar sound that specific guitar sound um my tortoise is literally just trying to bite me she's such a little fucking bitch she's always just 
she's just a little bitch. I'm telling you now, if you get, if you think about getting a tortoise, just bear in mind they 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 attack you a little bit, okay? Um, anywho, um, yeah, it's definitely giving me. It reminded me as well of uh, what's that song from Pop Fiction? It's just that thing, like you know what I mean. It reminds me of like I don't know, the '60s, going surfing, the waves, and just. I think you guys know what I mean. Uh, very great production. I love her voice as well. She has a very, very unique tone. She seems very, very cool. I love both of those. Thank you so much, uh, Zeb, for those requests. Thank you all of you for this uh, part two. Um, I loved everything. Uh, I love you. I will see you guys for part three next week. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. If you have subscribed, I love you. Love you, gonna follow me on Instagram guys, gonna follow me on Twitter, and yeah, goodbye. Oh!